Hello everyone, let's recap what happened at the World Superbike Race at Aragon in Spain. And well, it went to the Spanish rider who added to his Super Pole Race victory with a win in Race 2 at Motolan Aragon. Well, we are talking about, of course, Bautista. With Race 2 at Motolan Aragon came a second Motul FIM Superbike World Championship win of the day for Alvaro Bautista at the Pierrelli Aragon round. After starting for first place following his Tissot Super Pole race victory, Bautista claimed victory by more than 4 seconds as he claimed a slender 3-point lead in the championship after the season opening round. It was a thrilling battle for victory. The fight for victory was a very, very close affair with Bautista doubling up for victories on Sunday with a win in race 2 as he withstood early challenges from teammate Michael Ruben Rinaldi, Jonathan Ria of Kawasaki Racing Team World SBK and Toprak Raza Gatloglu of Yamaha with Briggs World SBK team. Bautista hit the front on lap 3 of 18 before looking to pull away at the front of the field. He was able to take advantage of Ria and Rinaldi, battling over second place including Ria running wide at turn 1 on lap 4, which allowed Rinaldi through to second place with Raz Gatloglu third and Ria fourth. Two laps later and Ria outbreaked Raz Gatloglu at turn 1 to move up to third, while on lap 11 Rinaldi ran wide, which allowed Ria back into second place. Raz Gatliaglu initially dropped back but then he closed the gap to Rinaldi in the closing stages of the race. On the next lap, lap 15, Raz Gatliaglu made his move into turn 1 to move into third place before settling his eyes on Ria. Although he could close the gap across the final four laps, Ria held on to second place with Raz Gatliaglu third and Rinaldi fourth. With victory, Bautista leads the championship standings for the first time since Misano in 2019, which is a gap of a huge 1022 days as he claimed the 18 win of his world SBK career. Ria and Raz Gatlerlu claimed second and third place respectively and for the first time the same three riders shared three podiums at the opening round of the season. Ria's second place means he took his 175th podium with Kawasaki and 218th in his career. Moving ahead, Alex Lois of the Kawasaki Racing Team World SBK finished in fifth place as he bounced back from his race one crash to claim a top five finish as he laid home independent rider Axel Bassani of Motor Corsa Racing in sixth place after the Italian made a good start to jump up the order as he looks to continue up his form from 2021 where he impressed as a rookie. The battle for seventh featured four riders with Loris Bass of Bonovo Action BMW, Javi Vierge of Team HRC, Garrett Gerloff of GYTR, Yamaha World SBK team and Iker Lekuna of Team HRC. Paz was able to get ahead around the halfway distance of the race and stayed there as the lead BMW rider in race 2. He was 0.865 clear seconds of Spanish rookie Vierge who finished as the lead Honda rider, although he was just 0.616 seconds ahead of Gerloff. Lekuna had been ahead of Gerloff until the last lap but found himself demoted to 10th on lap 18 of the 18-lap encounter. French rider Lucas Mahias of Kawasaki Pocchetti Racing came home in 11th place and two seconds away from the battle for 7th on a strong comeback weekend for the Frenchman. So we have got you covered on mostly most of the aspects of what happened at the World SBK Racing in Spain and we hope that you really enjoyed this and for many more insights and details on motorsports happening around the world you know that there is only one stop that's Foven Motorsports. Do not forget to log in and of course like and subscribe if you have not done it already. This is me your friend Mitrojit Biswas signing off. We'll be back with more updates till then. Take care and bye bye.